So you forgot to pack your Apple TV remote before you went on that long vacation for the summer. But then you think, I can just use my iPhone as a remote. Brilliant thinking, but unfortunately, you have to use your Apple TV remote to connect to Wi-Fi in order to do so. Well, don't worry, I'm here to teach you a method to connect your Apple TV to a wireless network without an Apple TV remote. First of all, there's some things you'll need. An Ethernet cable, a standard remote control, it can go to a TV or a DVD player, for example, and an iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch running Apple's remote application. Set up your Apple TV just as you normally would along with the Ethernet cable in the back of your Apple TV and into your network's router. Open the remote application on your device and let it find your Apple TV. Using the remote application, navigate to Settings, General, Remotes, Learn Remote, and click Start. Now with the spare remote you found, follow the on-screen instructions. This process will allow the Apple TV to intercept the remote signals to pair the devices. After you've completed the instructions, you've successfully taught your Apple TV a new remote. Now you can unplug the Ethernet cable from the Apple TV and router. With your new paired remote, navigate to the Wi-Fi settings and set up your Wi-Fi normally. And there you have it, you just set up your Apple TV's Wi-Fi without an Apple TV remote. And if you like this video or any in particular, go ahead and subscribe, and until next time, this is Wireless Hotshot. Thanks for watching.